One of the final two contractors for the ground-based strategic deterrent program was in Great Falls last week to meet with the Chamber of Commerce. MTN's Margaret Marco has more on the importance of that meeting. So at Northrop Grumman, we're very excited. Uh, we like to say deterrence is in our DNA. Northrop Grumman Ground-Based Strategic Deterrent Program Vice President Carol Erickson says the company has been involved in the ICBM system since the very beginning. We've been leading the um, sustainment and maintenance of the ICBM contracts, and today we're the lead of the largest um, ground subsystem sustainment contract. They are currently in the first phase of the ground-based strategic deterrent program. It's all about performing trades for the Air Force and developing the initial design. So we're looking to find the right balance between performance, cost, and risk. The Air Force has told contractors they would like the next generation of the ICBM system to operate for 50 years or until about 2075. Northrop Grumman is working on a design that will replace everything from command and control to the missile itself. So we're here to interact with the local leadership to really understand the unique challenges and opportunities of fielding the next generation ICBM system here in the Great Falls community. The plan is to start putting the new system into place in 2028, so Northrop Grumman is looking at potential local contractors. They are looking at the work base and the infrastructure needs it will take to put the new GPSD in place. Uh, so we're in the very early planning stages. So we know that it's going to have a very long um, and sustainable impact on the community, uh, but it's a little early to say exactly what that impact will be. Margaret DeMarco, MTN News, Great Falls. It will be three years before the Air Force awards the contract to either Northrop Grumman or to Boeing.